What's up, guys? Look, man, I got some information for y'all, man. If you think about coming to Maverick, man, I'm gonna put you ahead of the game. You gonna get off. You gonna you gonna leave that program. You gonna know what to do. You gonna know what to do before you go to the program, man. Check the Instagram out. Check the Facebook out. I got how to use the the, the red binder, how to use the yellow binder, how to use your tablet in the truck. All type of stuff, man. Uh, I even show you how to uh, how to secure shotgun cool. If you've been watching my channel, man, y'all know I put y'all on straight game on a lot of stuff. And I got on my Instagram, Facebook. Y'all check it out on the left side right here. Look, everything on here, man. Check it out. What's going on, my good people? Today, we're going to learn how to put our, put our breakdown in. Because just in case you get a flat, anything could go wrong with this truck. You want to put your breakdown in, so... The the uh, the guys that do the breakdown for Maverick let you they'll know that you know you break you know you broke down the side road or whatever or the truck stop and you put your location in and stuff like that. I'm gonna show you all that. So don't worry because you gonna you gonna have service on your uh, tablet to put it in. So don't worry if you don't got service on your phone, you can, you can chat on the uh, tablet. So I'm gonna show you all that. So first I'm gonna show you how to do the breakdown. First I'm gonna show you how to do the breakdown. Let me go to the front of the screen. So you just gonna go to forms, then you gonna go to 36. This this number correctly. So one, two, three, four. You see how this 31, 32, 33? Well, 33 not here, but 32, 34, 35, 36. So we're gonna hit 36. Break down with trailer. So you're gonna put your exact location, your HUD ring, which your HUD ring is gonna be your mileage on your truck. Then it's gonna be uh problem type, it can be Power units, which is the tractor, um, mechanical trailer, tire power unit, uh, which is the tractor, and the trailer is the you know the trailer for the tire. So whatever it is, you submit it. Boom, you submit it in. Then after that, TTN gonna call you. TTN is they work with Maverick for your breakdown, so they are gonna call you on your number. So you are gonna answer it. The lady gonna be like, oh. Uh, where you located, what's the problem? They're gonna ask you again. Even though you put it in the tablet, they're gonna ask you, they're gonna ask you again. As you hit submit, they're gonna ask you what's the problem. You know, and you're gonna put your tire, whatever, whatever you need. But you're gonna you're gonna tell them what it is again on the phone, where you at, where you located, and they're gonna give you an estimated time where you know the vendors gonna come out to come fix your whatever your situation is. They like to get somebody close by you. So usually take about about 30 minutes. Sometimes I stay about an hour and a half. I remember the longest I remember staying an hour and a half. So they fairly quick. They fairly quick. Um, after that, you get done with that. You gotta make sure, make sure you put your breakdown pay in because if you don't put your breakdown pay in, you're not gonna get paid at all. And you only have so much time to even put it in. You only got so much time. They only give you 12 hours. So breakdown request pay is number 63 on your tablet i'm gonna show you again go to form number 63 breakdown see how they say the request must be submitted within 12 hour repair complete complete your pro number is whatever your work assignment number is so to go to there you got to go to your workflow and it'd be your work your um, pro number will be over here so when you go to your uh workflow which is this right here on workflow. Then you're gonna go, it's gonna be right here, the number gonna be right there. Then after that, let's go back to form. Let's go back to forms. Yeah, right there. Then after that, driver code, name, Xavier Mount, breakdown date, whatever the date you've been break, you know, been um, broke down. Then your time, what time you know you broke down, then completion date and time, location, is it as near player, yes or no, and then you just submit it. After you submit it, you good to go. Uh, you're gonna get paid on the following week check. So that's what it's gonna be on. Um remember payroll for Maverick in Saturday at midnight. So that's how it works. So that's how that works for the breakdown. But also I'm gonna give y'all another little tip. So let's just say I don't know. You took a week off for of Maverick for vacation reason, whatever. You just take a week off. You put your your uh, request and take off a week. You got stuff in your refrigerator, right? Go ahead and take that stuff out your refrigerator. If you know it's gonna spoil. And to save your battery in your truck, so I remember one time I didn't turn my battery switch off, 
and I had to uh, I had to get that battery charged up. And um, I remember my female always told me to do this. You always wanted if you stay in the, if you was out your truck long as a week, you know, you're going on vacation, whatever, you're taking a little trip. You want to make sure you hit this switch off right here on the side because every married truck got a switch on the side. This is side right here. This is switch on the side of the truck. Every married truck have it. So you just want to hit off and all your, your stuff in your truck going to be off. Everything going to be off. So you ain't got to worry about nothing going to be on your truck. Then you, you know, you go back in your truck, you can just turn it back on and you'll be good to go. Um, no problem next week wherever you come back you'll be good to go so you do them things man say the engine you know, say your battery and stuff like that you ain't gotta worry about it going dead when you get out the week but that's what you need to do for breakdown and that's what you need to do when you you know you want to take off whatever but yeah man y'all got any questions about marriage transportation or flatbed questions during i'll be glad to help my information the screen and i will get back with y'all later i almost forgot guys i had to show y'all how to go to the chat so i gotta show you how to go to the chat so if you lost service you can go to the message right there you go to your message right there and it will show you you can get you can get in contact with ttn that way which is the vendor so you can go that route so if you don't have no service so you can do that too